Here I have a ESP32 microcontroller, a relay modem with two channels, and some uh, basic components such as female header, domino, and one tap ball. With the following component, we will make the relay control circuits like this, and with a little of this, we can control the electronic device using the web server on the mobile phone. So first, let's talk a little bit about the hardware. I am using the ESP32 with 4 megabyte memory. This is the basic version of ESP32, so you can use any version with your hair. Next is the relay modem with two channel. This modem operation at five volts. The so CPIO level on ESP32 is 3.3 volt, but it will be okay. Some basic components such as female header, domino, some wire, and one tap ball to connect anything together. So let's move to the solder phase. Oh, before that, we need to repair the hardware a little bit. This is my favorite step. I love watching the sound of flow and this to the ball. Oh, to fix the ball on the table, I usually use the solder pay like this. You just need to fit the circuit to this and it will keep the circuit stable. Now let's test soldering. Now we need to connect the CPO together. So for the relay modem, we will need the VCC, CND, and two CPIO. VCC is five volts, and I will choose the CPIO four and CPIO two for the application. For connection, you can use some wire. It is good enough for the demo application. But if you want this device more stable, I recommend you to decide the PCB for it. Ah, uh, it looks not good, but I think it will be fine. Let's move on to the programming phase. First, let's talk a little bit about the, how this device works. ESP32 will connect to the Wi-Fi router and will be given an IP address. On the browser, I set the IP address of the ESP32 and you will see the simple web server interface with two buttons. List on the button. An event will be sent to ESP32 and ESP32 will control the corresponding CBIO. At the same time, send a signal to your browser. The program will be divided into two parts. The first part in the web server includes HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. File saved on the memory of ERP32. The second part is the program on the ERP32 to control the relay. So first, we will init the serial box. It will be helpful when we want to debug the program. Next is to add the necessary library. Here I will add the Wi-Fi connection library, web server, and list of MS. So next I will configure the CPIO to control the relay. CPIO being two for first relay and CPIO four for the second relay. Next is the list of MS configuration session. This is a necessary library to store the CSS 
HTML, JavaScript, Free Fire, directly into ESP32. So next in the Free Fire connection, I will configure the SSID and password as well as in this the Wi-Fi connection. And the last part in the web server configuration. Here I will flow the index HTML, style.cs, and fit.js from the ERP memory using the little MS. Then this is the necessary code back function to handle event when you press the button on the web server. Similarly, when you press the button on the web server interface, it's will call this function. So for the program for the web server, we will create new folder on the Arena project folder. Change the name to data. So on the folder data, we will create three files, the HTML, CNN, and JavaScript. HTML will contain the main structure of the program. CSS contains the UI configuration. In other words, it will help your web server look better. JavaScript contains the main logic of the web server. So now we need to update the software into ESP32 for the HTML, CNN, and JavaScript. You just need to read Control C P and list on a plus list of MF into ESP32. For update the software for ESP32, simple press button. So for step 10, I will do the browser on the mobile phone and set to the IP address on ESP32. Now we can see the basic UI interface. Press the button and we can see the status of CB wall chain. So, okay, from the basic component, now we can make the relay control ball. If you have any questions, leave the comment. Thanks for watching. See you next time.